Number 10, who are some of your favorite YouTubers? So I actually have, I, I'm probably, I'm, I think I'm subscribed to like over 200 people uh, on YouTube. Uh, a lot of people I watch, uh, I, I, my, my taste in YouTubers is very broad. I go from vloggers to, um, to gaming channels to the top 10 channels and, uh, and like, okay, let's name some. So vloggers, I don't really watch vloggers anymore, or, or I, I very rarely watch vloggers, but one of the people that really inspired me to start vlogging was Joey Graceffa. Um, like, I remember back in summer or like, um, it wasn't, he wasn't really an inspiration to start vlogging, but he was one of the main reasons why I continued to vlog. Um, I just really saw how fun and how much fun he had. So he's definitely one, what, Joey Gershoff is definitely one of those um, YouTubers that I really look up to. Uh, and that has helped me uh, throughout my journey and actually got me here to actually just continue making videos. But I actually don't watch his videos anymore. Uh, one, because I don't have time, but um, yeah, I really enjoyed his, uh, in his content. Um, another YouTuber is uh, Strawberry17. Uh, I don't know if you see my strawberry shirt, but she was definitely one of those um, YouTubers that I really like watching. Um, I will watch Captain Sparkles for gaming, uh, Nerd Cubed for gaming. Um, what else? A date? A date? <laughs> um, Nate. Uh, Nate wants a battle. He's really great. His music channel is absolutely amazing. If you guys want to check that out, it's really awesome. Um, Plackner Comedy, MMPR Toys for the toy stuff and the nostalgia stuff and the 80s stuff. Um, MMPR Toys is for the uh, my, is for the Power Rangers stuff. Obviously, I watch toy reviewers. I do top 10 stuff, watch Mojo, Screen Rants, that kind of stuff. Um, Cinema Sins is definitely one of those things that I really look forward to watching every day. Um, and uh, I don't know what else did I watch this morning. Um, but yeah, I just I, I watch a whole bunch of YouTubers. Like I don't stick to a specific genre, but I very I'm very broad in, in the things that I watch. Like Fine Brothers and and I, I be, like the makeup tutorial people, like makeup gurus, like those kind of people. Like I will watch literally any kind of video if it's on YouTube. How to basic is really good too. Number 11, what does your username mean? Uh, so I created my username back in 2009 um, because the story behind my username is that I was really into this girl back in like fifth grade and when she made a YouTube channel, her YouTube channel name was Funny Girl Kid. I don't know if you can probably go back and look for it, um, but basically I was so into this girl, I made the YouTube channel name. I made my username after her, uh, so I just went funny guy kid, and she got really mad because of that. She was like, now people are gonna think I'm your brother, or, or you're my brother, or whatever, I don't know. It was really weird and really dumb, but that's the YouTube name that I'm stuck with for now. Hopefully I can change that. I think I can change that. Hopefully I can change that, but eventually, but thank you for YouTube for making the, the, like, the, user, like the screen name thing, so I can actually put Calvin Lee in the corner, and not funny guy kid. I hate people, I hate telling people my, my channel name, so I just tell people to search for my name and I'll be there, but yeah, that's, 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 that's the story. A girl. <laughs> Number 12. Best thing about YouTube. Best thing about YouTube is it's constantly changing and they don't tell anyone. It's totally kidding. <laughs> you watch the video, like, of how YouTube is being dumb. So many people have talked about how YouTube is being dumb, but probably the best thing about YouTube is me being able to just put my content out for the world. Let people see it. If they want to enjoy it, then they'll enjoy it. But if not, it's there for me. And it's definitely some place where I can just put stuff and hopefully YouTube doesn't shut down because I need all these videos to stay somewhere. Um, but definitely YouTube has given me this platform to express myself. And that's basically, that's, that's really just the best thing. Also, for me, videos. <laughs> Number 13, worst thing about YouTube. Well, I kind of just said it. <laughs> the ever-changing platform, the ever-changing uh, operating system or algorithms that they have. Operating system stack. Algorithms, their platforms, their displays, their 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 format, their all that kind of stuff. Everything that's changing, and the fact that they don't tell anyone that it's changing, and they kind of just do it. It's really annoying. It's probably the, it's definitely the worst part of, of YouTube because it, it hurts a lot of channels and it hurts a lot of content creators, like big content creators too. Um, and, and there's just me who's like, oh, I don't really care. But then again, I do care. Number 14, what are your goals when it comes to YouTube? So, when it comes to YouTube, 
definitely one of my goals is just putting out content that I like, putting out content that I want other people to see, putting out content that I want to see, and putting out content that really just captures the moment and really makes it so that I can look back on it and, and just just do whatever, you know, and that's basically my goal is just to do, is just put out whatever and hope for the best because in the end it's really not for anyone, it's really just for myself and I really like just expressing myself like this and I hope that like I will continue this goal and just, you know, propel myself into something better, hoping my, by doing this, my artistic talents and my creative talents and the cinematic stuff will definitely improve. Um, and that it's not just all a whole bunch of this stuff. Also improving on the public speaking, because definitely YouTube is definitely improving on public, public speaking um, without the ums and the uhs and the uhs and the uhs and, and the, you know, all that kind of stuff. Because back in my day, back, back in my day, back in like 2012, which was four years ago when I started vlogging, I sucked at vlogging and definitely my goal is to continue to keep making myself improving myself through the things that I do on this channel. Number 15, any advice for new YouTubers? Um, be yourself. Do whatever the hell you want to do and just be yourself because in the end, don't do it for the subscribers. Don't do it for the YouTube money. Do it for whatever makes you happy. Do it so that the content you create is really something that you're proud of and something that you want other people to see. And, you know, it's just... It's just one of those things where you can't have other people tell you that it's really great. You have to know that it's really great and just put yourself out there. Like, don't be afraid, just do whatever you want and there's gonna be an audience for it. Like, I did not expect people to be watching these videos, but there are and, you know, there's going to be people who want to do this and there's going to be people who are going to beat you down but really it doesn't matter in the end and I hope that new YouTubers get that and, and, and hopefully that, that transfers over to the new generation and that other people see this and hoping to become YouTubers will, will become just absolutely amazing people and, and just propel themselves into excellence. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, just talking about me with my YouTube life and basically it's a really small tag, but um, it's definitely an insight onto my YouTube history uh, and the things that I used to do with YouTube and just how I've grown and my thoughts on YouTube and all that kind of stuff. So I hope you guys really enjoyed that video. Um, definitely uh, if, if anyone wants to do this video, go ahead, do it. I really would love to know your guys' YouTube story as well. Um, but other than that, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow in a brand new video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. The power protect you. Happy birthday to anyone who has a birthday out there. I just burped. Damn. Happy birthday to anyone who has a birthday out there. And I'll talk to you guys tomorrow.